My dudes, we are here waiting for the 2.7 special live stream of Honkai Star Rail. And of course, I'm not live streaming at this time. And I do apologize for that. I had some things come up and I really just wanted to spend some time alone. Now, before we get into the actual live stream, which we're, you know, getting ready for it. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe down below. And make sure to also check out the ever wonderful gamer subs. Use code TYSTER for 10% off. As of the release of this video, we will be getting a Mori Calliope and a Crony drop from Hollow Live, and we'll also be most likely seeing some really, really cool stuff at the same time. It's going to be sick, but without any further delay, let's go ahead and dive in because we only got 20 seconds left. Now, again, I do apologize for not live streaming this, y'all. Uh, let me go ahead and turn it down just a, just a smidgen right i do apologize for not live streaming this i usually live stream these but i got a little bit in my own head about some stuff and wanted to take some time to decompress and everything but we are here and we are ready for my wife i'm all dressed up for her. i can't wait for ting yoon come here baby Bugway, it's whatever finally sparkling clean yes mm. huh? mm? who is ruining the conductor's work Though this feather does look similar Sunday. In shape to my What's up, feathers, buddy? It is of a different color and thus unlikely to be mine. Well, come on, conductor. You know Super me. Well, I it makes sense. It, it makes sense that else. there would be somebody else besides Fugue. I, really I think Fugue was much, part of the strike, so she didn't have enough, right now. or the voice actor didn't have enough time. But I don't know. Hey, you feather shedder. It's oh, literally what? just speculating. Is making me I also don't want people to think that, so like, you know, you. I'm being overly positive because the last one I had people saying I wasn't positive enough. <laughs> but I am very excited for Fugue. Here we go, trailer, baby. Welcome to the party car. Nameless. Party car, baby. Commence. Wait, we get a we get a tub. Let's go. May not be able to get a party started right now, but do we? I, please tell me we actually get to see everybody here. in the tub. The I'm just saying. Are numerous, and yet <gasps> there she is, baby. That's her. That's her. Mi amor. Oh, I missed you. Oh, I knew you were never dead. Oh, she's gorgeous. She's just as beautiful as the day that we thought we lost her. Oh yes. Go away. I'd like to take some time to look back. Who knows what it fed? Sunday's just walking through the streets like people don't recognize him. That's crazy. He looks like Albedo a little bit. To the stars. Should one desire to leave the stage for good. One must first step back onto the stage. Oh, snap. Herda, what's Herda doing? Okay, okay. We're getting a big Herda update, it looks like. Oh, there's Herda right there! The Herda! We got to see the Herda already. That's insane. Alright, so we already got our first... Uh, we got our first code, which I'm not supposed to get a live chat. <laughs> that's, a, that's another thing. I was like, oh, wait, I wasn't even... Uh, paying attention to that. Usually I actually uh, post these in the chat, but wow, that trailer was so good, actually. Uh, like, not even like super, super good in the sense of like, oh my God, there was like, you know, all these cinematics and stuff like that. It was more so like getting to see the characters and seeing that it's not going to be a super, at least from what it looks like, not a super story driven update, which is fine. Like, I don't mind that just so long as the quality of life updates and the events bring a lot to the table that's what i want that's why i didn't entirely like the rapper update with 2.6 because again there was just it was just a bunch of stuff that did not just get get grab my interest the banana monkey stuff was just not my thing and then the events were okay and then the live stream didn't help that at all but you know what it is what it is this update looks like it's already going to be a lot better wake up it's time to do the introductions Man. Dizzy. Why are you so dizzy already, dude? <laughs> Where am I? Uh, oh, God, Fu Gui looks so Once freaking hot, dude. Time, I love her. You were the center of attention. You owned the mic, and the whole cosmos was at your feet. When your mic was on, 
Even IPC execs had to make way for you. I think they're playing I'm at so what's going on with Fugue, which is Who are pretty you guys? sick. Uh, you even forgot us? I'm That's a, I seventh. Long time no see, everyone. I am Sunday. Hello, everyone. I'm Pom Pom, conductor of the Astral Express. It's a pleasure to be a part of the special program. Well, since Albert lost his memory, uh, I'll be the host this time. That way I'll get paid double. Huh? huh? I suddenly remember everything now. Oh, yeah. Okay, Albert. Again, it was a play on all that. Concept of a week. Do Monday, do Sunday. By the way, look at this dope-ass birthday present I got. Between. Pokemon Stanley. I'm not even a Stanley guy. But this is a custom Pokemon one, and I'm sick. On the I'm, I'm sick with it. Oh, I see that Mr. Owlbert has recovered. He even improved his life. Is that the power of a salary? <laughs> Stop. But keep going. This special program where I get to see everyone is what I look forward to the most every season. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the night amnesia is nothing compared to this show. Aww. You're so what adorable, Albert. Oh my god. It's really emotional to share the stage with Mr. Sunday again. <laughs> the performance in the Penacony Grand Theater still seems like just so I will say I am very glad with the least voice acting in this one so I know that people when will probably like say like oh so I'm overreacting but the last hey, live stream with 2.6 where they had the bird chirping stuff was very annoying to me uh, now, so I'm very happy that we don't have to deal with that again that was that drove me nuts again are you but if you want to promote a seven-day weekend I think I'd be down for that. <laughs> well. Oh, and I also saw Miss Ting Yoon in the trailer. Yep. She's wearing such a gorgeous dress. She's so gorgeous. I really wonder what she went through. She's so gorgeous. Down, March 7th. I'm just saying, y'all, <laughs> if anybody in my chat Firstly, goes to Throne and somehow finds a Ting Yoon uh, body pillow and wants to buy it for me, for just, just say so. <laughs> Why are we showing Sunday first? But that's his ultimate, I think. I am very happy with how his outfit is with this. I think his OG outfit is really, really good, but I like this as like the kind of the transformation of Sunday from like, you know, overarching villain to now, you know, whatever he's going to be doing. You know what I mean? Star Rail Sunday. Yes. Do you all remember at the end of version 2.3? The great Madame Jade rescued Sunday and gave him such kind and caring advice. Oh, oh, child, go see what this world is truly like. Mm -hmm. uh, He's gonna go adventuring. Mr. Sunday, aren't you gonna say anything? Why do I feel like that's not how things played out? <laughs> He's just telling the story from a different perspective. Perhaps what that lady Bonna Jade said was true. Descend to the mortal realm and walk their lands. Hmm? See what this world is truly like. He was he was trying to see that things through a god's eyes when Penicone he's not he's not a teach immortal. A he's deal. not a god. Remember, you're not an I'm omnipotent no being, Sunday. But a mere escaped fugitive. Eek! Escaped? And you're just gonna walk around in broad daylight like that? Yep, he's gonna walk around when the like, like dude. Caught by me and him have matching Emily? hoods. I'm more so it trying to look good Mr. for my girl Fugue, you know what I'm saying? To to I'm just saying. The secret aid of a oh, we kind of look like Sunday a little bit now I that I think about see. it. So uh, instead Mr. of uh, gray Sunday hair on my head, see. I have gray hair I've in, in my beard. for so long. I still have some connections that are willing to look out for me once in a while. Seems like your robe and hood are also there to conceal your identity. Indeed, mm. wise conductor. My Good original job, Pop, outfit Pop. stands out far Call too Call your much. mom in the room. Show her how great you are. Somewhat to avoid if anybody can name where that quote's troubles. from, oh, like, you immediately get a heart from me. I'm just saying. That quote has stuck with me since, like, the PS2 days, man. Set, and he had to get a new outfit, I'm just saying I'm old AF. He's got no clothes left. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> Mr. Sunday was once the bronze melodia and spent years listening to others' confessions, and yet he's now an escaped convict. <laughs> that this is a pretty crazy a contrast. experience now. for someone who used to be a high and mighty head of the family. 
Oh, the crew totally knows how that feels. Bellabog I really, really hope he, he becomes a Celeron hunter. Posters. It'd be so sick for him to be a part Mr. of the Celeron hunter. Wanted poster would look like. Traveling with Blade, Kafka, and uh, um, in order Silver to preserve Wolf. the dreamscape's stability and, Firefly, and avoid arousing Firefly. too much suspicion. Mm -mm. Wait, no mm -mm -mm. posters? <sighs> Trust me, it's a very unique How experience you, to collect wanted posters of yourself. Same. Should I get someone to draw one for Mr. Sunday? <laughs> we are doing that, well, a lot of said. yapping. <laughs> I heard some strange rumors circulating around Pentecote. <laughs> Something like <clears throat> Mr. Sunday got hit by a car and is currently resting, and the culprit of this traffic accident ran away. Uh, <laughs> well, what a strange rumor. There was no traffic accident. It was all about the power of the uh, friendship. Yep. <laughs> Good job. Uh, let's get Good job. back to the previous topic. Yes. Let's you talk about. You won't be stirring up trouble in Penicone this time, right, Mister Sunday? Uh, of course not. It's not just the Astral Express and Penicone that woke up from Anna's dream. I woke up too. Good job. Having discarded the blessings from both the Harmony and Order. I will now pursue the utopia of my dreams as a mere mortal. Let's I go. I return to Panacone this time, only because I wish to complete a final performance before I embark on a new venture. Basically, Lord Dumbing for Sunday. You know, Seems more like Lord Dumb, which is good. A deeper meaning this time. Yep. Yeah. <sighs> Curious? Then please experience the story for yourself in the game. And for more tidbits on the journey, Sunday took to pursue his dream, <sighs> as well as the story of how he fell into thorny paths many times. Thorny paths. Back out every time. <laughs> He'll show it all. I just gotta the say, big shout out to country. Albert, man. Stay tuned. Uh, yay. Albert's so Stay dope. Tuned. I dig the voice let's actor. Let's have a look at how Sunday performs. Let's death. talk about the kid, baby. I am an imaginary character, following. Oh, no, you're not. You're harmony. immortal. When using my technique in the overworld, I will leave a halo that buffs my teammates. Mm. My skill causes one designated ally character and their summon to immediately take action Ooh, and increase okay. their damage depth. Yeah, so that makes sense. He's going to be really, if really good for like Jing Yuan, Topaz. Even higher. That's However, pretty good. Be aware that when Sunday uses his skill on ally characters following the path of harmony, they are not able to immediately take action. March 7th, mm. don't you think those golden figures that fly out when Mr. Sunday flips... So you can rock them with a double harmony here? team, but you just can't oh, use I your buffs on a harmony character. Okay. There's side. a little bit of a restriction, when but not that my much. Ultimate, I shall spread my wings and regenerate energy for one ally character. That blessed How much character and their summon will become the Beatified for a number of my turns. Ally targets who have become the Beatified shall bear a halo. And have their crit damage increased. Ooh, okay, so he's he's gonna be helping with crit. Okay. I do think that he's gonna be really really good for pure fiction. Of course I can. Then what about So that makes a lot of sense, especially since we're gonna be getting more erudition or another erudition character with the Herda. So he might be really really good for the Herda team. If Mr. Owlbert doesn't mind the immediate increase to his workload, then I suppose. So wow, he's gonna help out summons. <laughs> and he's gonna give crit damage. <laughs> now that we've talked about Sunday, it's time to get reacquainted with Miss Ting Yu. Yes! Fugue. Oh, it's just Fugue? It's not Fugue? Fugue. Oh my god, she's so beautiful, dude. I'm, a, I'm, about, I'm about to become like Queso when it comes to this girl. Oh my god, just sit. Sit on me, please. She's so beautiful, dude. I love her so much. Oh my god. Bro. 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 Oh my god. Those eyes, man. Foxy and women, baby. Well, that's a long story. Miss Ting Yun literally had one foot in the grave after her encounter with Pantelia. It's mm -hmm. only thanks to the Genius Society's Madame Ron May that she regained a Thank you, Ron May, another hot Madame woman May resurrecting another hot woman. Right sciences. 
Not long ago, Himiko and Welt met Miss Ting Yun when they visited Madame Ron May, and we voluntarily um, took on the task mm -hmm. to take Miss Ting Yun. I do home. remember that. That's the express crew for you. Eager to help is basically our middle name. Bro, I However, Miss so... Ting Yun wanted to stop somewhere before reaching the Sien Zhou, so she could calm her thoughts. It happened that the express needed to pick up supplies at Penacony, so she came with us. I see. I am curious, however. What is worrying Miss Ting Yun? Oh, maybe it has something to do with this new name? Fugue? I suppose the name Fugue combines both her regret of not having returned home for so long and her confusion regarding her current identity. Miss mm. Ting Yun doesn't need any Makes help sense. with daily life, but Pom Pom often sees her spacing out on her own, like she's thinking about something. Is she going to be really a consistent hard. traveler of the Indeed. Astral Express? After I kind of want to know that. With death. It'd be really, really it's cool if they added her as like an Astral Express member person. to help out uh, on the inside Madame of the Ron train May or something. May healed Miss Ting Yun's body, but it looks like her spiritual wounds can only be healed by Miss Ting Yun herself. Makes sense. Passenger March, sense. you and our Gray Trailblazer know Penacony inside and out. So can you two take Miss Ting Yun for a stroll to cheer her up? Absolutely, 100% I will do that. You don't need to tell me twice. I will absolutely take her on a date. I mean, I will take her around Penacone. Penacone, the planet of 100% I'll do that. This is the place to get cheered up. 1,000%, bro. I am thirsty. And the only thing that'll quench my thirst is Ting Yun. No problem. Believe it to us. And for more details regarding how Miss Oh my god, what a... Please stay tuned for a Bro, why can we not have alternate trip. costumes? Yay. Please give me that costume. Let's talk about Fugue's abilities. Let's talk about it. Fugue is a fire character mm -hmm. following the path of Nihility. Yep. While she's on the field, allies' attacks against weakness broken enemies will additionally deal super break damage. Another wow. break After damage you. you <laughs> Fugue can increase the ally character's <laughs> break effect and give them the Foxy and Pear effect. At the same time, Fugue's own basic attack will become enhanced. Okay, so when she uses her skills, she enhances her attack attacks, and others. There's also a chance to reduce the enemy target's defense. Ooh, okay, defense shredder. Fugue can deal fire damage to all enemies. And this attack ignores weakness types oh to reduce God. all enemies' toughness. Oh my God, she's Such so hot. gorgeous tail. She is so... Are there nine of them? It appears Madame Ron May made some optimizations when re-sculpting Miss Ting Yun's body. Using Fugue's technique in the overworld can inflict daze on enemies in a set radius. Entering battle by attacking dazed enemies will okay. advance Fugue's action and reduce the enemy target's defense. Those foxy I love her. tails are really captivating. I love Aww, her so much. I just want to bury my face in Miss Ting Yun's tail. I want to bury so my face happy. in Miss Ting Yun's tail as well. <laughs> <sighs> the conductor will be upset again if we get fur all over the express. Hey, I do not care. No ruining the express's Pom Pom can <laughs> eat a. <laughs> so let us have a look at version two point So phase one is going to be Sunday with Queen Yi, Ar first half Arlen, and Ting. It is it is a travesty the that they did not put Ting Yun with Fugue. It is a travesty they did not do that. We'll the irony would have been so good. Jing Yuan getting a rerun. Okay. Makes sense with combination of Sunday. Gallagher, Yukong, and freaking. Oh, what's his name? The limited five star light cone. Oh, I feel so bad. In the second half. I feel so bad. Firefly rerun? Oh, that makes so much sense, though. Same time. I can't believe I forgot his name already. <laughs> Blue haired uh, boy. Oh my god. Firefly rerun. Okay. It's been eating away at me. A new venture on the eighth dawn. Are we venturing out on a new trailblazing expedition again soon? Uh, are we are we skipping 2.8? Did we not have a 1.8? End of the version 2.3 Trailblaze mission. Farewell, Penacony. Black Swan recommended that the express crew head to Amphorius. Amphorius. So that's the where we're going next. Eternal land, a place where even the eon of the Trailblaze Akavili failed to reach. 
In the version 2.7 okay. Trailblaze okay. mission, a new venture on the It is pretty crazy to think that we are going to a new world finally, and we're getting that much closer to the Fate Stay Night collab. Just to be on the safe side. At the same time, the crew stops in Penacone for the last time in preparation for their departure. Uh, then what about Mr. Sunday? Well, Mr. Sunday, <clears throat> he is caught by the crew right then and there when he goes out with one week. <laughs> Don't that spoilers, a man. Seems like the robe and hood didn't do much. I have to say, that I will be paying attention to this story. Exceptionally sharp. I did not pay attention to the rapper story, to be quite honest, but... Getting caught by the express crew isn't a bad thing. <laughs> We're not going to turn in you the in version Sunday. 2.7 Trailblaze mission, Sunday's destiny will also change based on the Trailblazer's decision. Oh? Does okay. the Trailblazer get to make a choice again? Well, as to what kind of story will unfold among the crew. That's going to be pretty Sunday. crazy if they actually change Please like stories because of it. In the version two but at the same Trailblazer. time, I don't think it's going to be too big of a difference uh -huh. because it's going to be very yeah. weird to be developing two different stories for Sunday as you continue on into 3.0. Like as, when you see him again. In Penacone, as well as the prologue. To the brand new story in version 3.0. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Going straight into 3.0. To ensure that everyone has a good experience with the story, this version has added a story recap function. Ooh. Before starting a new Trailblaze mission, you can select to review a summary of previous Trailblaze missions. For example, Ooh. since you've experienced several Trailblaze continuances in a row between versions 2.4 and 2.6, you can use this function to record your journey. That's good. I might, do, I might actually use that to be quite honest. I, Trailblaze mission. I might oh, I actually like use this. that. That's pretty sick. If you want to know how things are going to develop, you should read the story recap first. Well said. Here's another example. For this show to continue to the next segment, we will also need to have a recap. Uh, what? Uh. <laughs> Amphoria! The Eternal Land! A place where even the eon of the Trailblaze Akavili failed to reach! Navigator Miss Hemiko decides to go seek information about Amphorius just to be on the safe side. Gods may have cast down the flames of wisdom. Oh, we're actually going to get a little bit of a lore? Are lit by humanity. Amphorius, through strife, writes of the intersection of three paths. It is a world where heroes across the land embark on the flame chase journey together. Ah. Humankind rewrites destiny. In the legend's beginning. Oh wait, we're actually gonna get a full trailer? Chaos. Then the gods cast down the cool flames. Is this Aglia or the Titans? Uh, uh, Aglia? Is this Aglia? The Titans carved the heavens and earth. Three wove the threads of fate. Three molded life with their hands, and three guided calamity's gate. Hey, yo, hold the on titans a second. blaze enlightened civilization we're actually getting 3.0 right now thrived endlessly okay so the, it makes sense because uglia i think was a god of beauty in greek mythology and it looks very greek mythology-esque it makes a lot of sense now maybe a lot of the characters are going to be more greek mythology driving the titans to madness and the mortals to mutual war oh king dead across the land and the stain of blood consumed the light of dawn. As the gods waged war, the sun itself grew quiet in awe. A millennium of divine conflict left only a shattered world and an age of darkness. Ominous AF, let's the go. The flames flickered and dimmed, and the age of the gods met its end. Golden blood fell to the ground as a distant prophecy resounded. God. Flow, golden blood, flow. Oh, this looks Converge so sick. A boiling river that flows to the heroic heirs of this world. Yep, there's Uglia right Aglia, there. The gold weaver, 
You must gently caress the holy city. So it was uglier that talking. And talk okay. to the sounds and voices of destiny. There shall be the three-faced messenger traversing. Okay, another new character right there. Okay. Tidings to you from hundreds of worlds. I don't know if that's gonna be actual character and though. Anaxagoras the foolish has enough knowledge to. Ooh, who's that? And to stir up a torrent capable of slaying gods. Ladies. Go seek the priest who severs dawn from dust. Pink-haired, pigtail girl. Okay, looks like Barbara a little bit. From which she wakes. Yo! Oh my god, I can't I can't wait for that character. Oh my god, he looks so sick. Set her in motion, Cypher of the Fleet. Cat girl! Let's go, baby! And that servant of the hand shadow, the daughter of River Styx. If you grant her the right to embrace, then even frozen death will sleep. She looks so cool! Oh my god, okay. You will hear the sound of the ocean's abyss Oh wait, are these the different the gods? Is that you like will okay? See outlanders from far away realms visiting under the veil of gloom until the journey's end. I think they made a reference to Fate Stay Night right there. I think they made a and thing about the Fate Stay Night characters right there. Sends the throne alongside countless heroes to embark on the grand mission Whoa. of deliverance. Okay. I gaze towards the distant future where the sun shall etch the footprints of humanity. The children Look at all the characters right there! The so Christ it is gonna be good. Oh my god. Pluck the gods' core flames and once more uphold the world. Oh my god. The there we go, cat girl. The oh, she's got house. freaking death looking girl has elf ears. Among which even life itself holds little value. Therefore, we cast even ourselves into the flame. Wait, what are those other four characters? Only to inspire hey, yo! the green stroke. Bro. And the Bro. Of creation. Oh, 3.0 looks like it's going to be so sick. Oh, my God. Most There's the herd of heroes' journeys in the universe are just dice tosses they threw on a whim. Will your answer be any different? Amphorius. There we go, the Herda. Of course, this will be a romantic story like none that has come before. You think so too, right? Wait, what does that mean? Wait, what does that mean? Is the MC gonna get some freaking, like, is, is the MC gonna get some? I thought that freaking Firefly was the one that gave us a verse. Or was going to, but maybe we actually get... Dude! Okay. Obviously, it means romantic in a different way. I know this. I'm not dumb, and I'm not, I'm not being a coomer. I'm just trying to make jokes. But that 3.0 trailer looks so good! Oh, my God! Dude. This is me, again, not to, not being over overly positive. But if it continues with like the greek-esque thing right that we might have just seen a bunch of the new gods that are going to be coming out and that's so freaking cool i'm so pumped for 3.0 i haven't been this pumped for like a major update since honestly when we started uh fontaine like i got super pumped about bomb fontaine for genshin impact so i am pumped for welcome this. back everyone did you notice that the studio we're in this time is very special would anyone like to guess where we are? It looks like the Astral Express. It does look like the Astral Express. I don't remember having a car like this. That's right. We are That's in the right. Astral Express coach. This is really a car on the Express? Looks like it, March. Nobody tell me that we've got an extra one. March, the conductor worked so hard every day to clean so many cars. Did you never notice? This party car has been here since completing the Trailblaze mission. The voyage continues. In other words, since the Trailblazer boarded the Express. Well, hang on. I... I you, Way to go, Seventh. You've been here the entire time, March. <laughs> You've been here the entire time. What are you doing? Fine, fine. Just treat You're my favorite dimwit. My <laughs> kind friends. Could you please reintroduce this car to me? <laughs> Not to worry. 
<laughs> Welcome, dear. Okay, so it, it is going to be like a party car. Okay, cool, cool, cool. I mean, they already kind of confirmed we have a it, but. Spacious reception area, a cool toned marble bar, and a nostalgic bar. That would be really robot. cool is if they made it multiplayer the in this. People could visit your like a area, and like it'd be like VR chat, and everybody just comes in, talks, all that stuff. Guaranteed to That'd be cool. Most it's never going to happen, box. but it'd be sick. Dear guests. Would you like a glass of the Trailblazer special? Yes. Wow. It looks really good, actually. Oh, <laughs> uh, wait. Very plain, but really Where good. Where do those stairs go up to? Not like plain, All plain, but you get what I mean. Would, of course, lead to the Trailblazer's room. Well, when Yay! Room? <gasps> Besides, this room is such a mess. It's obviously a story. Oh, we're, we're absolutely going to be able to decorate it. This We're gonna be able to decorate. Room that's been there since completing the Trailblaze mission. The voyage continues. Indeed. <laughs> Even though there we was get to no decorate extra passenger cabin room for the Trailblazer. A lot smaller of an area than the Serena Teapot. Oh, I dig After it. After the Trailblazer boarded the Express, the crew decided to give to them the second floor storage room in the party car. Also, the largest room on the Express. That's right. That's right. <laughs> it was definitely not an oversight by the devs. <laughs> what? Am I wrong? Or is the world wrong? <laughs> All right, enough. Arch, your room is already established. The Get over. Trailblazer's room will finally be implemented. You can just stay in my room the whole time, March. Thanks for waiting, everyone. I told you this is a new feature. Well, now that I look at it. This room is pretty barren despite its size. There's not even a bed here. Is the Trailblazer gonna sleep in a cardboard box? Of course not. In the version 2.7 event, Cosmic Home Decor Guide, the Trailblazer will renovate and furnish the barren storage room and make it a room of their own. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, that sounds super fun. Uh, but renovating sounds pretty difficult. Where should we start? You'll be okay, Mark. Not to worry. The reliable conductor has already set up a zoning plan for the Trailblazer. Yeah, I want to know right. if we get to the customize it ourselves or are we going to follow a plan? Zones, such as a bedroom and a bathroom. There During the event, Trailblazers need to obtain furniture using This a is why I'm so glad I picked Stealth. Duties ...and fill up the empty room little by little. Once complete, the Trailblazer's suite will be truly luxurious. So I'm guessing Not it's more preset, which kind of sucks. But at the same time, but like they gotta add some sort of like of. customization to it. It can't. It can't just be, you know, oh, it's just gonna be this from now on. There's gotta be some sort of customization to that's gonna make people want chores. to go into that room Rewards a lot of the time. Work, it would make sense. It would make sense. To maintain the express. Uh, that's true. We can't let Pom Pom do the sweeping on their own every day. So what exactly do we need to do? Before each round of duties, the Trailblazer needs to put together a duty team and finish <laughs> together. Duty. Different team compositions will trigger different combo effects to help do chores more efficiently. Trailblazers can use action cards to effectively plan out actions on the schedule and obtain corresponding work contribution value and fun. Sometimes you'll trigger different random events as you work. It's just a planner. Create wonderful memories with different. It's batteries. like um. Um, while we're it's like duty, the March seventh training can thing. Can we slack off a little? Just a little. Haha! -ha! The conductor anticipated that some of you would slack off. Pom Pom will be holding irregular dinner meetings during the duty period to evaluate the work contribution of those on duty. The evaluation results will affect how much funds the Trailblazer will receive. However, the Trailblazer can also use various tactics and meeting abilities during the meeting mm -hmm. to get the best score possible. Okay. Oh, so properly so it's almost like Yahtzee. meetings can get Pom Pom to give us more pocket money. <sighs> almost like Don't Yahtzee. Touch. Hey, Pom Pom heard that. Well, the meeting's outcome was mostly based on the duties done. Besides. Once you've got enough express funds, look, our bed is big. Exciting renovation segment. Yes. Wait, oh, don't oh, okay. hard enough. You can get all the Hold on. I want to make sure. Does that I mean that we can customize it? It doesn't look like we could customize it, but also, I want to verify you that. Renovating the zones in the room, you can unlock the conductor's new outfit. Really? I can we get a new outfit for a little pom pom, buddy. 
we got pom pom costume before we got costumes yeah. for the others. Pom coat room is on the party car's first floor. SMH man. Feel free to give it is a cute outfit. On the conductor's everyday outfits. I can't wait. It's a cute outfit for our boy pom pom. Preview of the room. Just for reference, not a problem. Close your eyes. Just take and me in there. Them. Now the Trailblazer has returned to their own room. Dude, Ooh. that is a sick uh, room, actually. Tired after a whole day of trail Dude, blazing. do you know how many cats I could put in there? The first thing to do after putting on some slippers and heading to my room is to have a lovely hot bath. Yes, sir. That's a big. So Bro, that is not a bath. That is a hot tub. I think it is a present left by Mr. Zhao Cho. Oh. After finishing the bath, you can jump into the Bro, big comfy bath. bed and enjoy some rest and <laughs> I ever get a house, I'm gonna be like, that's the bathtub I want. In the game room, full of top-notch gaming hardware. Wow. Heck yeah. Playing games and we get an arcade awesome. cabinet, dude. Our room is the best. The middle of the room, we'll show the collectibles the Trailblazer has found. There we go. Various worlds. There we go. That's the customization, kind of. If you That's your pretty path, cool, actually. The weapon shown will also change. There's also a tea room full of snacks, drinks, and so glad. Yeah, uh, let's go. The to Dude, is that a hamburger made out of a cat? cat burger. <laughs> it's I a cat burger. Dude, I want a cat Even burger so bad now. Built this room through your own hard work. Of course you like it. But That's no pretty matter sick. how comfy your home is, don't Between forget to go outside friends. once in a while. Dude, don't tell me to touch grass. There are other events than version 2.7 yep. waiting for you. Indeed. In the version 2.7 event Between the Frames, the Trailblazer will become Miss March's assistant photographer and head outside to take pictures with her. Oh, oh boy. I fired up March's enthusiasm for photography again. Oh, look. The famed director, Mr. Rekka, is working with Paperfold University to... Are we not leaving Petticone, so it makes sense for her to take pictures, but... Mr. Rekka has assigned various photography tasks with different themes. During the event, the Trailblazer and I will photograph suitable scenes together to finish these things I mean... Out. The Trailblazer and Miss March also have a chance to obtain special items during the photography session. Okay, cool. Sessions. Perfect. You might get surprising photos by using them. What Let's kind go. of special okay. items are there? For example, Sparkle's kaleidoscope? Uh, I feel like we might see something super That would be pretty cool. Director Sparkle's lens. After completing Mr. Rekka's tasks, Trailblazers can use this chance to invite friends made during the journey. Okay. As well as members of the Express crew to take a group photo together. Uh, yay. Just give me both Ting Yoon. Ting Yoon and Fu. And now. There's a Divergent Universe update we'd like to bring to you. Another this Divergent update, Universe update. We've added some curios and weighted curios. Okay. As well as equations and random occurrences. Mm -hmm. That's right. In version 2.7, the save file from the Divergent Universe will also last longer. Thank Instead God. of refreshing every Monday, the save file will now reset whenever the Divergent Thank Universe... Thank you. Oh, update. my that God. I was getting so annoyed with that. that. You've worked hard to get. I was getting so annoyed with that. I still need to go through Divergent Universe and actually max out and get done with that. But it's so annoying. I have to do it every week. Thank you. Oh my god, yes. Trailblazers will be able to switch with the theories of the brand, brand new Rick Rick Mechanics. Uh, let, me, let me see. After the version 2.7 update, the different stage effects right. for each period will become different grit mechanics? That's right. Grit Activate mechanics. grit mechanics in each battle to rapidly accumulate grit value. Once full, characters will enter surging grit, gaining powerful buffs that can help you defeat enemies faster. So basically, it's a big buff to help people finally finish uh, pure fiction. Dude, they make this game super easy, baby mode. During surging grit, the Trailblazer can also accumulate a certain amount of resurging tide through defeating enemy units. When surging grit ends and you return to Concordant Truce, the previously accumulated resurging tide will turn into grit value. 
helping you to save up for the okay. next surging grit. I dig that. So it's Again, like it's going to make pure fiction like easier for people. Money? <laughs> <laughs> Which, After I guess, it, like, it's a single player game, so making it easier for everyone to beat changes. it is good. Non -boss enemies will but at the same time, this is supposed to be... Also, this is supposed to be hard mode, right? So you got to find a healthy balance. By defeating non-boss enemies. Yep, Once they're making it way too easy boss, now. You can instantly enter the next wave. They are making it you way mean, too easy. You can also kill mobs as soon as possible to defeat the boss. They are making oh, it way too easy awesome. now, in my opinion. Now like, pure fiction is supposed to be endgame content, but at the same time, I guess it really just depends. Also, the new non-boss enemies allow us to trigger grit mechanics faster and enter surging grit earlier. There are okay. also some hotly anticipated quality of life changes in coming. Okay, For let's hear it. 2.7, the highest quick clear floor in the Forgotten Hall will be adjusted from floor 7 to 9. Thank in you. Other words, as long as one successfully clears the Forgotten Hall floor 9, one can obtain all rewards from the nine floors at once? Let's go. <laughs> Thank like you, sweet you merciful baby Jesus. Seven floors worth of rewards by clearing floor 7. In version 2.7, we will yeah. also be reducing the size of the game client file, helping Trailblazers reduce the amount of storage Good job. needed on their device. Good job. There will be an option to delete past resources on mobile clients, so you can delete some audio and graphics you've already experienced to save storage space. Good stuff. Good I stuff. I need that. Can't have too many files on my device. Last but not least, it's the oh. new version content we are all familiar with. Firstly, the beloved Gift of Odyssey. Gift of Odyssey will be arriving in version 2.7 as always. Gift of Odyssey, baby. <laughs> Always so yes. good. Beautiful. Rainer, Fissure, and Realm of the Strange Events will Beautiful, beautiful. Keep it coming. Complete them to get double rewards. And now, it's time for a short break. The program short will break. resume in just a few minutes. I wonder what else they're going to actually announce. Okay. So, we got some good stuff. Like, the events are kind of meh. But being able to actually have our own room and being able to customize it a little bit is still kind of a win, right? I think that's a win in general. Um, I don't know. Like, the events, again, are good. Like, I, I don't think they're bad. I think they're they're either eh, to good, you know? Um, being able to dress up pom-pom in a new thing is pretty dope. Um, pure fiction, I feel as though they're making it way too easy now. Like, granted, it was tough. Like, I felt it was tough at times because for me, I don't have a lot of time to build every single character. I'm still building a couple of my air edition characters. Um, but I feel like now they made it very easy, right? Um... Which I guess it makes sense to keep more people playing. Makes sense. Plus they have Apocalyptic Shadow, so endgame makes sense. Like you could use that, but at the same time, I don't think they should make it too easy. Welcome no? back. Like we've mentioned before, we're about to head to version 3.0. Oh, we're getting 3.0 announcements. Use this special program to preview some important information about future versions. Okay, let's hear Firstly, it. We will be implementing Remembrance, event, baby. The path I'm so excited for this. 3.0. Some of the new friends the Trailblazer will meet at Emporia will walk the path of remembrance. Makes sense. Oh? What kind of special mechanics does this path? Yes, have? that's what Characters I want to know. Just walk in the path of remembrance have summons called memo sprites. Different memo sprites have various specialties and can take on different duties in battle. When fighting in the same team as those following the path of remembrance, Memo Sprites will also Don't become reliable on-field teammates fighting beside you. So basically ah, a fifth, fifth team member. If you have four That's remembrance, true. then you're going to have like eight characters. Will be very different after this. Uh, it does seem like that. That's pretty dang cool. Okay. During version 3.0's trailblazing expedition That's pretty cool. I will dig. Oh, I, so I, I dig that. It's it's a unique right? mechanic, yeah. I guess, in a way. Version 3.0. Even though like some of the Erdish characters have the summons and so to hunt and all that, so. <laughs> as a spoiler, there will not be any new trace materials for other paths anytime soon. <laughs> we'll be sure to tell you in advance when there are new materials. Yeah. And there's another piece of news. Wishful the resin will also be updated in version 3.0. Let's go. Self-modeling resins to set a relic's main stats. 
Okay. You will be able to set a relic main stat. Please do not let it be as bad as Genshin's. I am begging you, Honkai Star Rail. Please do not make it as bad as Genshin's. So you can consume a certain amount of the new item, Wispo Resin, on top of consuming self modeling resin to simultaneously set a relic's main and substats. You can also convert self modeling resin into Wispo Resin. Okay. <laughs> mean the trailblazer needs to save up their self-modeling resins how i wish we could get more wishful resin so one the will get you one stat will before be it gets you two official announcements how does that make sense special though? program is aired <laughs> remember to save your self-modeling resin and plan how you want to use it after reading the announcement in addition also, look more into that. also introduces a chance for you to redistribute a relic subsidiary stats and oh my god enhanced gold rarity relics only these changes will be explained in more detail in the future that is so now, good please enjoy the oh my god give your penicillin vacation to that is such a good <laughs> freaking addition right. right there that brings us to the end Bro, of this episode. That's a huge win. It's time to say goodbye. Wait, Mr. Albert. What? Pom Pom found something in the storage boxes when clearing out the room for the Trailblazer. What you got something there, Pom Pom? Definitely be interested in. Really? Pom -pom okay. Get it right now. Let's hear about it, Pom Pom. Uh, <laughs> huh? Bean soda, spring water, soul glass, trick snacks, cusp for wraps. <laughs> coming through, coming through. Can you wings and tails? Whoa, so many delicious snacks. Oh, thank you, Conductor. Oh, not these. Here, it's this one. Oh, Ooh, golden was ticket. That a five star selector ticket for regular five star. Hey, hey let's go. Hands. Trailblazers can claim gift of the express and obtain one regular five star character of your choice. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> this is so good. Beautiful <laughs> Hawkeye Star Let us thank Rail. the conductor for their generosity. Bravo. Free five star. The conductor simply found this ticket in the gift box. No one knows who put it there. <sighs> but it's Looking only journey, the basic five star, so. I but like but it memory. is free regardless. Okay. But the trailblazer That's a win. Never ends. Gronya gonna Both get another one. Or Himiko. But I pulled a lot of Himiko. And keep fighting side by side. Thank you, Trailblazers, for your unending support throughout this journey. Uh, Ow. And now, the version 2.7 special programming. Why don't we take a group photo together, Conductor? Sure. Passing Sunday gather. saying we should take a group photo uh, is insane. Well, She's gonna be like, Kawaii! Watch. Oh, never mind. Ooh, what's this? Okay. What's this? What's this? It's the Herda! What you doing, the Herda? Oh, no. That's it? Is that it? Is that the end? That's the end. Okay. So, a lot of things to talk about here, okay? A lot of things to talk about. We got some big, big news. Oh my god, dude, this is insane. So we got a bunch of stuff for 3.0. We know that we're getting a bunch of stuff regarding like, you know, like just a bunch of lore in general for 3.0. And then we're getting the new resin stuff going on. I'm really, really hoping that the resin is not going to be the same thing as Genshin's to where we only get, we have to buy the battle pass and then you get like some and then you have to get the rest through destroying other artifacts and or relics and blah, blah, blah. I really hope it's not like that. If it's not, then great. But what's really, really cool also is that they did add uh, the thing where you could actually like change the distribution of a substat to another, which adds a whole new perspective to relics that we've had in the past. Now I'm wishing that I would have kept the defense relic one where I rolled four times in the defense. That would have been great. That would have been so great. But I do think overall a lot of good things coming. And it's, again, this is a goodbye to Pentacone. Uh We're getting Sunday. We're getting uh, Fugue, which is fantastic. I love her so much. So break effect. 
mainly units, which doesn't surprise me. Uh, they're really pushing the super break effect. Sunday's going to be very, very good for pure fiction, it looks like. So I'm pretty excited for that. Story looks like it's going to be good. Um, I really want to know, like, everything that happened with uh, Fugue as she was, like, going through all that stuff. So, um, But yes, this was a great live stream. I think that this was way better than the Rappa live stream, to be quite honest with you. A thousand times better. So... Let me know in the comments down below what you think about this. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that wonderful good stuff. Again, sorry, guys, that I didn't stream this myself. I just wanted to make sure to, you know, get some good mental health ready. So, anyways, y'all, that's going to be it. Love you to death. And as always, we will catch you in that next video. Please take care and be safe.